Now introducing to my right, his opponent, the Beast. He descends from Kodiak Island, Alaska. Fully erect, this beast stands over eight feet tall and weighs in tonight at 1,089 pounds. He can digest over 60 pounds of food in a 24-hour period. He possesses the ultimate appetite for destruction. Meet the Beast, the Alaskan Cruncher! Now again, the contest begins as soon as the bear eats the first hot dog. And it is underway. There we go. There we go. And there's Kobayashi using his technique. He breaks them in half, and he puts as many as he can as well. But the bear is going for it as well. Look at that, Mike. No hands for the oh, bear. Kobayashi. Look at him staring at the bear. Look at Kobayashi watching his opponent. Now, I wonder if it's, if it's the same feeling when he's in a competition with a human being. Steve, I've got to tell you something. When the bear came out, I saw a flash of fear for a second in Kobayashi's eyes, because he, he's never faced a competition like this. It's unbelievable. See how casual the bear is. Now look at how many hot dogs Kobayashi has left. I, I, I don't see how he can beat this bear. You got to remember, Kobayashi is an eating machine. He's got a formula down where he just goes, never takes a break. He's steady. Right, and he also, as you can see, Michael, he has the water there because his mouth gets dry and it helps him digest the exactly. uh, hot dogs. Well, Kobayashi is the greatest professional eater in the world. He's got this eating technique down to a science. It's one minute into the competition now. Kobayashi's doing very well. The bear is, is scooping them up, but, you know, obviously it, it, it's got a very different approach to eating. But see, he, he looks away and he takes a break because he doesn't know it's a competition. He's just a natural eating machine, and he'll, he'll take a break, look away, look at the lights, look at our cameramen, while Kobayashi never stops. You can see that dish is going down in front of Kobayashi. And look how skinny Kobayashi is, and, and look at the size of the bear. You know, I was really impressed when Kobayashi first came out. He's in great shape. You can tell he's an athlete. He's got uh, great biceps, and, he's, and he came out with a small stomach. He won't leave with one, but he's, uh, he's a fabulous-looking athlete. Two minutes into the competition, Kobayashi is watching that bear like a hawk. That bear is definitely going through the hot dogs, Michael. He is, he is, he's making a strong lead. He's I can't making count. a dent in that dish. I yes, guess. he is, and I cannot count them from the angle that I'm at right now, but I would say he is in the lead. It looks like we're going to have a winner very shortly. The bear is now looking at Kobayashi. Do you exactly. believe that? Exactly. He's, he's being distracted, and this is what Kobayashi is counting on. But Kobayashi hasn't missed a beat. He's, there's only the a few bear left. has only maybe six, seven hot dogs left, and there it oh goes. Oh my God! Oh my no God! Hands. There's only three hot dogs left. There was only three hot dogs left. Kobayashi has got to be panicking. There's only two hot dogs left. There we go. He's down to Kobe, the last Kobayashi one. must know. That's it. This is going to be. And that it. is it. We have a winner. The it's bear, over. the beast, has won. The Alaskan Cruncher is our new champion. Yes. Incredible event. All right, I'm here with Steve Martin, the bear handler. Did you have any doubt? Well, you know, when a bear comes in, he's this bear is really hungry. So when they come in like that, they're going to chow right down. But I have to give it to him. He really did a good job on keeping up with the bear. It was a real close race. Were you afraid at all? <laughs> yes, he was very scared. It was a big, big bear. I want to train and beat the bear the next time. I, if, if there is a next time, I'd like to come out and try it again. Well, congratulations. No human being can beat you. And our special thanks to Michael Buffer. It was an unbelievable contest. Sometimes you get the bear, and sometimes the bear gets you. Tonight, the bear got Kobayashi. Still ahead, place your bets. Who will win as 44 little people and an 8,800-pound elephant pull two DC-10s across the desert? Meter sprint. And they're off! But first, who'll be king of the jungle, man or beast?